back. Hey man, I, I gotta tell you, I gotta be honest. This has been the longest short week that I've ever been a part of. Um, I guess this has been my third short week, but uh, on top of that, you know, let me start off by saying I want everybody to have a, uh, a happy Thanksgiving and make the best of it. Eat as much turkey as you can. And I know fish doesn't sound right to be on the turkey table, but uh, I don't think it'd be a problem. I don't think it would offend anyone if you, you know, substitute that bird for a big slab of fish. You know, it's kind of crazy to be able to say that. I think we had a really good, uh, I think we had a really good week of preparation. I mean, from Sunday, we only had about, we'll see, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Three days of preparation to get ready for Houston, who's coming in. Right about, what, 9-1, I think it is. You know, they, they've been playing some really good ball this year. And it's going to be important that we start the run game as usual. I mean, you can tell they go from week to week. I mean, team, every, everyone that we played thus far uh, definitely has a threat at the run game. And this week we're, we're going up against uh, you know, Aaron Foster, who, <clears throat> who is definitely on his way to a Pro Bowl season. And not to mention that there's also, there also going to be two Johnsons on the field this week. And I tell you what, man, it's going to be a sight to see um, two great athletes. Uh, both Pro Bowl selections. I mean, you can't beat it, man. It's going to be a live game. It's going to be a very happy, thanks, thankful and Thanksgiving game. I tell you what, though, um, on top of that, man, this week has been really interesting, you know. Uh, just having to push through it, man. A lot of soreness still having kind of faded away, you know, you're still dealing with a lot of aches and bumps and bruises from, you know, the previous game last week, which was a, which ended up being a shootout for us, but, uh, you know, that that's a part of the job, that, that comes along with the territory, and, and uh, being able to bounce back and doing whatever you got to do to take care of your body, and, you know, uh, to get ready for the next game. With our current record right now, I mean, every game for us become more critical and critical every week, but, I can assure you that it's not going to stop us one bit. It's not going to slow us down. We're not stressing about the, the record part because we don't. We know that you know the games that we've been defeated. It wasn't a lack of uh, physical ability or um, I don't know, you know, um, tenacity, or attitude. You know, it, it, we don't lack any athleticism. We don't lack any of that. It's just when I mean, we've been falling short somehow, but uh, we just got to figure out how to, you know, to, uh, you know, bounce back from it and uh, come back and be very productive this week. And like I said, uh, the Houston Texas men are going to bring it. You know, I think our matchups across the board would be probably one of the best matchups we've had all season. Um, you got JJ Watt on the other side over there, man, who's been playing some hell of a ball. Um, Quarterback has only been sacked about 13 times, I think, this season. One of the fewest, if not the fewest, in the NFL this this, this season. And uh, you know, we got some guys all the way across our board who will be going against guys like you know uh, Newton and a couple other guys that got it going across the board. But at the same time, man, it's going to be a very physical game. So when I mean, you guys sit back, enjoy your turkey, and let us do the work. Hey, have a happy Thanksgiving, and uh, I'll see you guys next week. Thanks.